So you can get four cartridges for eight bucks. And I was looking at the Target brand replacements for the Gillette uh, Razors or whatever. Because yeah, that, that's going to be the cheapest that they have of that model. Right? Twelve bucks for four. So, yeah, like 50% more for the same number. Yeah. Just because it's compatible with the G Gillette brand. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's why I'm glad that Razors are going through this fucking, you know, well, as I said, kind of a consumer revolution. Yeah, I think a large part of that is, you know, the internet and the popularity of Dollar Shave Club. Like, Dollar Shave Club was, even though it's, it's cheap, it's not as cheap as buying directly from the people that supply them. But, the popularity of it and the awareness that you can get good razors for less money. Yeah has really changed yeah like a lot of people are more aware of that now also I, we're finally i think starting to see the mainstream really like understanding buying digital yeah you know, buying online yeah instead exactly of forcing the own stuff always going to start always going for just the old brand recognition like yeah. finally seeing hey that really is incredibly unnecessary yeah but i mean we're also getting like brand recognition for new brands because they're they're disrupting the, the marketplace, it's, you know, the terms are of it. That's, that's really what they're doing. They're like, hey, this is a new a new model for buying razors. And it's a new model for making razors, too. I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. Like, I was excited just to be able to find the, the ones that I've been buying. Yeah. But if there's going to be like actual better than mainstream ones for still less price, hopefully that works out. Like, like I said, I don't know for sure yet because I haven't tried them, but that's that's what people say about them is they're actually better. Got him. Good work. Now it's time for safer stuff, bro. Yep. This isn't even his final. <laughs> oh, that was kind of cool, actually. Yeah. Um. The white eyes. Those the dragon. are fucking like. Yeah. Yep, those are mines, and you can't shoot them. I can't shoot them. You haven't been. Oh damn! Yeah. Yeah, like if I shoot these things, it doesn't do anything. Yeah. There That's we go. That's how you do it. Yep. That's how you do it. <laughs> you get immediately hit. Cool! Yeah! Thanks! Fuck you! Thanks, dragon. Oh my god, the timing on that is really awkward. Is it? Yeah. Well, like, I have to... You have to, like, hit it so it closes and then hit them? Yeah, it's like I can't just mash on the combo. Yeah. Actually, I think what it is... is Ooh, watch out for the dragon, man. I'm trying! I think I have to use... Yeah, I gotta use the right ones. Oh. That's even worse. Yeah. Very specific ones I have to use. Yep. That, nice. does, that does explain why there's different colors. Yeah. It's really weird for me, like, because I don't have a, a player character that gets hit. Yeah. So I'm like, why is your thing rumbling? Oh. Shh. Yeah. I'm trying, but like I don't. Yeah, I, I don't. I don't know about this. You got four HP. That he keeps moving, and I'm having a hard time keeping up with his movement. Fuck! And the other one exploded. 
Okay, but now that I know what I'm doing, yeah, it's gonna be I pray to fuck we start from the second part. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I think we will. I think we will. Nope. Oh, yeah. No, we do. Yay! He turns into safe for Sephiroth again. Yep. Okay. There's nothing safer about this version of Commander Deco. Deco. I want to say Deco. That's what I said. Commander Deco. It sounds like Deco. Commander Decoration. He's the prettiest. He decorates extremely well. Well, like, he's the prettiest commander. Was that what's her name? Not a commander. <laughs> Well, I mean, that's kind of a subjective opinion anyway. Yeah. I'm voicing my opinion here. And I would say he's the second prettiest commander. I, I would need to see them side by side. We can just ship it. Ship it? Ship it. It's a commission of piece of fan art. Yeah, there we go. That's a good idea. Just the two of them together. Just standing there. Yep. Like, not even really interacting with each other, just both standing in the same space. Yeah. That's that's what I'm at. Damn, you're dragon, sir! Man, that's... That's what I say all the, all the time. Aw, oh, son of a bitch! All the damn time. I'm like, damn, you're dragon. I could have been using my charge shot the whole time. I just assumed it wouldn't work because uh, of the way the fight works. Yeah. I mean, granted, maybe it only works because it's easy mode, I don't know. Well, either way, it works to do it. Yeah, seriously. Dang! Ooh, another form. Presumably. Oh, maybe not? No, no, it has to be because it would have given us a stage result. You're in good form. Huh. He actually kind of does look like uh, Issa, even. Like, he looks more like a human the way Issa looks like a human, as opposed to the others that we've seen so far. That's true, yeah. Um, that. That's good. That's, that's a good thing. Uh, I'm, I'm certain. Oh, that's not good. I'm certain this is all going to work out. Shoot! Shut it off now. <laughs> Come out to play, monster. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit, my gun. You guys are... I was about to say, did he just handcuff us together? Yep. Why do you take your shirt off? Why not? Like, I really love the ending of Metal Gear Solid 1. <laughs> oh my god, it is! Yep, Sort of, is. except I'm not shirtless. Right, and I can't do anything, so it's all you. Do you remember Liquid Snake? Oh, oh. You were always the superior. Yeah, look at that overcut. Oh, I can fly. Oh, well, that's handy. No, owie! You know what? The that's... hell with flying! Punch him! Kick him! That's why you're better than Deco, because you can fly. He wasn't given that ability. Well, yeah, he was. He's just oh, not yeah, using that's it. right. <laughs> <laughs> he was doing that the yeah, whole time we were fighting. Time, yeah. <laughs> he can't fly. <laughs> He doesn't have an Epcot Center on his back. I mean, that's humans have Epcot Centers on their back, obviously. I actually, I wrote I, in text, I put that as a quote in Discord to Matt. Yeah. And he was just like, what? <laughs> I was like, well, this is why you should watch SGF. Yep. Cut. 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 Oh man, I almost pushed the skip button. Please don't. I don't want to, I just almost did because I picked it up weird. Huh. Um, They've been building this battle. up. Oh, sorry? A boss battle? A boss I think battle. that's what yeah, Probably. They've been building this up all game. She's this monster. This is a false form. And I'm, I'm really curious. What's it going to... Now he flies. This game's really good at interrupting me. Uh, <laughs> I'm really curious what she's going to look like. Now, Fuji. 
She just is the mouth. Yeah. We have to get away from that device. I'm pretty sure that's not going to help anymore. You know, I gotta say, all these characters look really tired in the eyes. <laughs> like, oh wow, what a fucking snipe shot from Mount Fuji! Who knew Man. Mount Fuji was the best sniper? Mount Fuji with that 360 no scope. Oh, now they're both going to become a monster. That would be like the first game. Sort of. Falling in the lava and then turning into the giant monster. That yeah. is the first game, definitely. Yeah. And it looks like that's what we're getting. Yep. Except, I guess in this case, it is both of them fused. Yep. It usually works the other way around, but both of you aren't human. He's not entirely human anyway. So, I don't know, maybe it's different. So go protect my soul. But as long as you're here, I can resist it. Thanks, gotcha. Alright. Sweet. Let's fight the Earth. Yeah. Anti-Earth just shows up for no reason. Or fight another battleship. Fight the sun. Oh, hey, we can see them together. Yep. I, I still think she's better. It's kind of hard to tell when it's a hologram, but... They're green is what I'm saying. Yeah, <laughs> right. They're I'm... green with envy. <laughs> They're both jealous of each other and how pretty they are. Yeah, it's true. Look at some kicking boots you got on. Seriously. Those, those heels on those boots, like, kick somebody with those, it goes right through their eye. Kick them in the sh... Yeah, never mind. But there's no the grill. It's kick him with the grill. Whoa, where'd we get that? Oh, 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 it's Earth behind us. Are we gonna stand on top of Earth and defend it like in the first game? Are we going to invoke the iconography? Oh, that's a giant laser. Why did, don't dodge it? There's a big important thing behind you. Yeah, you would know. I would know! I spent a lot of time doing that fight! <laughs> oh, there's no earth under us, though. There's no earth under us. What do we shoot? The rocks? <laughs> At least you have a health bar that actually, like, matters. <laughs> yeah, my health is now 1,000 and not 100, which is what I think what it was before. I was more than 100. I don't remember what it was, but I remember like you had half health and it was like 170. Or not 170. It was like 70, so. Yeah. You don't really pay attention to numbers around here. <laughs> Unless they're multipliers. And then we multiply all those 16 year olds. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's exactly what we do. We don't care about the laws about cloning. Laws about cloning or for law-abiding citizens anyway? Not us. If you're gonna break the law, then you're still gonna do things that are bad even if they're against the law. Man, we're getting really social <laughs> during this game. <laughs> we're really turning into socialists. That's right. Ow! I think that we should support each other and uh, give me all your money. <laughs> I am socialism. <laughs> I am America's belief about socialism. Okay, yeah, there we go. So it's the same thing with, like, communism, where it's like, actually, what people in America think is communism was not communism. They were calling it communism in Russia at the time to cover up the fact that they were just being capitalist shit -ass. Yeah. That is true. Remember, there's a... That's not entirely accurate either, but, like, there's a, there's a better name for it's, the type of system. Right, right, no, it's more accurate than... It's more accurate than communism. Yeah. Uh, oh wow, I screwed this up. Although it's presumably the final fight, so the fact that it's kind of hard and I don't know what I'm doing is... uh That makes sense. Yeah. It's final fight. I don't know what I'm doing. I never knew what I was doing in the final fight. You can't just walk from one side of the screen to the other and beat things up. 
But not as Guy, because the home version of Final Fight didn't have Guy. They came out with a, a version that was only him later to compensate. I thought it took out Cody, like it was Guy and Hagger, wasn't it? I thought it was, uh, see, I thought it was just Guy because it's called Final Fight Guy. It's called Guy, yeah. So, I don't know, maybe they did take out Cody. And it was Hagar and Guy, I don't know. Yeah. I'm assuming, yeah, I was going to say, like, I'm pretty sure that's a giant laser. Oh, another Death Star run, cool. Yay. You can do it. Oh, man. <laughs> That's a good Rob Schneider quote there. It's the only Rob Schneider quote. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, um, yeah. Yeah, unless we want to get back into the, uh, the comedy thing. It's the stand-up comedian that's on that game show thing. <laughs> but then even that, Adam Sandler had the quote. <laughs> you Ooh, the Ad Wizards that came up with that one! <laughs> yeah. It's really weird, like, that was, that was a pretty good s skit, because, you know, it had Seinfeld as the hook of that. But then, like, Dana Carvey, Adam Sandler, and Rob Schneider, that's a good, that's a good team. Well, it used to be. Yeah. Not anymore. Right, but I mean, like, for the time period, that's, like, the dream team. On SNL. Oh, boy. Like... Uh, I guess maybe Mike Myers, if he was actually still there at that time. No clue. It depends on what year it really was. I think it was like 92, so I think Mike Myers was still there. I'm, I'm, I, no, I'm sure he was still there, because, yeah, 92 is pretty early. Pretty early, you know, in the, what, 40 years that <laughs> SNL's been on. That's pretty early, 92. That's a long running show. Yeah. I one time one time I had a dream that I was like on that show as a cast member. And it was weird because I was like roommates with Jimmy Fallon. I mean, okay. Yeah. I'm not really so sure what the it's, so it's like that would have been at least a decade ago, where I probably would have been the youngest person ever to be on that show. Also, I'm very not qualified to be on SNL. <laughs> like, thousand percent not. Oh, qualified. here we go. Boss refights. Oh, it's this sequence of events. Oh, except that's different. Never mind. I said refight. Like, it's the same people, but this is not the same boss fight. That's like thunderous mixed with the Delta. Yeah. <laughs> More Pokemon! Yep, that's you keep doing that. It is not thunderous. No, the thunderous is green, so this would be tornadoes. I don't even know which ones you're talking about at this point. The gins or the genies. I don't know which ones those are. Ugh, man. That's fine. It's funny, because <laughs> I would know like quite a few, but these are these aren't that old. These are from like No, like even newer. Well like, these are from the black and white. Room. These are from the black and white era. Well, black and white. Dragons. I thought the black and white ones were dragons. Yeah, uh, the gins or the genies or whatever are like the uh, like the like the legendary birds. So there's always a trio that's also legendary besides the uh, main legendary. Yeah, no, like, I thought they added a trio for the main legendaries in Black and White. I, like, I thought they added a third one. Yeah, there's often that, too. Because, uh... Yeah, exactly. Exactly. And I can't think of any other examples, but, you know, that one. Yeah, well, because, uh... Oh, what's his name? Uh... Diamond Pearl had... Yaga and Palkia and Giratina. What was that big insectoid looking dark like fucking beast of the void thing? Giratina. Oh that was Giratina. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And that was the third the third legendary. But like in the first in the first generation, 
the two main legendaries are Mew and Mewtwo. Yeah. The the trio is the birds. The birds. And then the next one is the three dogs. And they never been a third person in Mewtwo. I mean, I guess unless you want to claim that Ditto. Mewtwo's well, no. <laughs> Oh, I mean, I, I guess, yeah, if you wanted to go with the the theory about Ditto being failed uh, cloning experiments. Yeah. I was actually going to say, if you wanted to count Mewtwo's two mega forms as two separate, like, parts of a concept. Uh, well, then there's... Which I don't. Then there's four for the other thing, because Rick Laser has a mega as well. And then Groudon and uh, Kyogre have primal forms. Yeah, but those, so like, have, visually, they... So and, those are six... Visually, they look like they've only just powered up. Mewtwo actually changes form. Like, his, his bodily structure changes, like, pretty dramatically. Well, yeah. I say pretty dramatic, you know, relatively dramatically. He doesn't stop being Mewtwo, but... Right. I like the buff, the buff one better. I don't remember which one. Was better. Letter. Uh, yeah, I, I always get that... I can't remember which one's X and which one's Y. Yeah, I always forget that, too. I think X you is want... the buff one. But you like the, the fighting one, not the psychic one. Yeah. 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 So I like I like the fighting one better too. That was that was always really difficult, like remembering between X and Y versions of things. And it's like, uh yeah, it's Mega Charge uh, the blue one. <laughs> I I prefer the not blue one when it comes to the Charizards two megas. Yeah, I, I I honestly think like they got the colors like reversed of what they should have been. Based on the typing differences. I'm gonna try to take out these things in a few minutes. Yeah, like one of my favorite megas though? Mega slow bro. I they gave they gave DJ a mega. Yeah. And it's not an X and Y! He's right. one of my main dudes, if not my main dude in my team in X and Y. One of the two gens I've ever played. And you can't get the Mega Form in that game. It's only in uh, Omega and Alpha. Yeah. Well, it would be the same thing, too. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, obviously. But, like, that just really irritated me because I didn't want to. I wasn't going to get uh, Omega and Alpha because I didn't play the original anyway. Oh, but you did already? Because I was going to say, if you didn't already get those, then you could just wait for Sunny Moon, which is like two months from now. That's what I mean. Well, like, the end of that train of thought would have been, yeah, I didn't get Alpha and Omega, or Alpha or Omega. I have been considering getting Moon, uh, but the person that was my main reason for doing that uh, don't really have them around anymore. Uh, the conversation I'm going to continue. That's but, right. point is, I'm considering getting Moon. Yeah. That may happen anyway. We'll see. Cool. It may happen just so I can have fucking Mega Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> no, man, Sun, Sun and Moon, like, maybe I'm biased because it's like the first games I haven't worked on in like a decade. But, uh, they look really great. Like, they look... There's so many like small little like quality of life improvements that I've seen and I'm like that is amazing. It's it's a small little thing that you wouldn't even notice most of the time, but it's like that is so much better. Like one of the biggest things for me is just the, the fact that when you walk up to a trainer that wants to battle you, it like you can tell that it's a trainer who wants to battle you, yeah. not another just not a random NPC who won't battle you. Yeah. Yeah. Like, cause it it uh, it this a black and uh, a black like shadow comes on the screen, at the top and bottom of the screen. Like that challenge look. Like if you're about to challenge somebody, the way you squint your eyes, that type of thing. And like that's great, cause then you can just like, if you're not ready for it, you can walk away before you get into a battle. Instead of like, is this person gonna battle me right now? I don't know. I only got like five HP. Oh, they're battling me. I guess I'm gonna have to reload or whatever. So that that's really cool. I I don't know about the Alolan forms though. That's it feels like they're getting into a little too many forms instead of new Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah, I can see that. Because I mean, 
It was it was fine when it was like Megas. I also and then like <laughs> Primals being an alternative to Omega. I mean, it really is a Mega form. They just called it something else. Yeah, exactly. But then a uh, different form just because it's from a different region is kind of weird. See, I kind of incidentally, I actually prefer the idea of a regional difference over Mega form, mm -hmm. uh, mainly because I'm an old Digimon fan. Mega form really felt like a fucking slap in the face. Uh, but I, the idea of regional differences, because they built this big world of Pokemon with biology and yeah. like whatnot, and in real life, what do we have? Regional differences between animals. Yeah, well, and it so, makes perfect sense. For me, like I actually prefer the idea of regional differences. Although from like a meta standpoint, I get why there are mega forms. Yeah, like I get that from a gameplay standpoint. Yeah, I get why there are mega forms, and I think that the uh, regional forms makes perfect sense as you know as far as like a world she turned into two beings yeah you didn't see that coming i knew that was gonna happen when we first met her god oh god oh god but yeah i'm, I'm not saying that it doesn't make sense or that whatever i'm just saying that it's a bit too many it's a bit too heavy on forms how many like the lower forms are they uh, I think it's like 12. Wow, apparently I stopped paying attention. It's like, I think it's like 12. Because <laughs> I can be like, it's just like 6. <laughs> and I think it's like 12. And it, I mean, I think it's kind of cool that one of them is Raichu. Oh, I, see, I didn't even know that one. Yeah, there's an Alola form Raichu. I did not know that. I guess that's pretty, that's pretty awesome. Maybe people will actually like use it. Use Raichu. I mean, she was bad. Uh, anyway. Yeah. We won't judge you. I mean, I will, but for other reasons. Mainly because I'm actually a judge on a show. Good work! <laughs> this now, is my explain, announcement. Explain that show that you're now a judge on. This one! <laughs> we we judge things now. We're just we're gonna give scores to every random thing. <laughs> I give. Uh, I'm so glad the game just checkpointed. I give Super Paper Mario. No, not Super Paper. I Paper Mario: The Thousand Year Door four out of five. It's a solid RPG. <laughs> it, it is. <laughs> All your friends transformed. You can't fucking pretend like this is inherently different. Oh, he became, he became Arceus. Sweet. Our saves? Uh, if you want to say it not correctly, sure. I've never heard anybody pronounce it Arceus. It's Arceus. Or Arceus. I've never heard that. That's the, Which is why I fucked it up immediately. That is the 100% correct way to say it. Man, they are very weird. Arceus? Like, Arceus. what? Well, it, the problem is I'm trying to say Deus. Because God, the yeah. Deus means God, and presumably the Seus part, or the Deus at the end part, was derived from that because it is the creator Pokemon. It's literally God. Mm -hmm. So, like, pretty sure they were... Sewer? Pretty sewer they were going with, you know, it trying to sound like Deus, but they called it Ark as well, which makes sense because Ark is a term commonly associated with certain concepts as well. Yeah. Certain divine concepts. Uh, so Arceus, uh, the most common pronunciation I've ever heard from other people was, well, Arceus, essentially, kind of not really saying this age. That's really weird, because I've never heard that one. I've heard Arceus. Yeah, I've never heard that. I've heard Arceus, and I've heard Arceus, and Arceus is the official term. But I've never heard anything that sounded all fancy-like. I, uh, my assumption is that it was supposed to sound like Deus, because literally God Pokemon. All fancy like. You know, like dysentery. Dysentery? Arceus? <laughs> it sounds it sounds like a villain character. Arceus. Or perhaps Arceus would be based on where I'm assuming the words came from. Um Oh, that's bad. If he could have done that before... 
Oh, good. Good. Yep. Yep. Now we got a protective thing behind us. Yes, it's that. Shit. Shit. It's that one. Shit. So anyway, uh... Fuck. No, 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 no. Shit, she's gonna get... Stop. Don't let her get hit. Don't let her get hit. I'm trying to let her get hit. Oh, God. No. No, 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 no. Oh, God. No, go away. I thought it was shooting at the whole time. Come on. These green balls. I'm not a fan of these. I'm really not a fan of these. Oh, God. There's so many orbs. Um, can I? Okay. Yes, I can. Oh, no, 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 no. 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 No, 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 no. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Yeah. All of it. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, 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 yeah, yeah, no, no, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, no. Ooh, boy. Shit! Okay, oh, wait, oh, uh. It's like, kind of reminds me of uh, Galaga DX now. Galaga DX, okay. Or Galaga Legion's DX. Obviously. Speaking of things that rhyme with Galaga, I played Gal Gun. <laughs> For a brief moment, I thought you were just like, things that rhyme with Galaga, I played Galaga. <laughs> I was going to be like, well, no shit, it rhymed. I played, with, I played Galaga the other day. I played Gal Gun. Pretty good. I'm sweaty. Well, yeah, it's warm in here. That, yeah, but also like, Fuck! So Gal Gun's fun. Have you played it yet? I have not. Are you going to? Maybe? It's an empty creates. Yeah, I know. That's why it was in Mighty Dug Bolt. Yep. I'd love for you to explain why? Me. Oh. I thought, I thought he was going to say that he was the monster. Kachi. She's just Kachi. <laughs> yeah, that's true, she is. What? Ah. Uh -huh. We have got to stop having... I, hmm, never mind. <laughs> People should start making credit screens over not black or starry backgrounds. But you can just do this and people can see that uh, we're blocking all the lyrics. I remember when you look the way. at the sky. <laughs> I remember the sky. We'll see that oh. game. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like People can see that we're we'll blocking see the lyrics. the hook again. <laughs> God Gun's fun, though. I beat it one... Almost... Almost two and a half times. It's just like a weird kind of on-rail shooter, right? That's the gameplay? That's what I mean. Yeah, the gameplay is just the... I, I know what the framing device is. I, that's what I mean. The gameplay is like a railgun. Right, but there's... There's more depth to it than just like the standard... Well, I hope so. Yeah. Because it is, well, you know, modern railgun game. Yeah. Oh, there's not a lot of depth to the railgun part. It's it's just straight up railgun shooting. It's it's that's. And it's broken yeah. up with a visual novel. It's broken up with a visual novel, but the visual novel has a little bit more going for it than other visual novels. Is what I'm saying. Well, it's um, it's a, a dating sim. Almost. Almost. It's almost that. It's like it's right in the middle between like a standard visual novel and a dating sim. I mean, that's what I always thought dating sims just were. So. Yeah. I, I wouldn't know that there were dating sims that weren't visual novels. Yeah, but it's it's pretty cool. Uh, my first playthrough, I was going for like... Uh, there's two girls that you can choose from on your first playthrough. And they're sisters, one's the older sister, one's the younger sister, or whatever. I was going for the older sister on that playthrough. Because you actually have to choose in the beginning. Mm -hmm. um, and I ended up in the middle of the game. I ended up with the girl that runs the academy store 
because, like, she's in a band, and every time I went to the Academy store, one of the things you can do is just, like, donate to her band. So you and kept I, doing that? And I just kept doing that every time I went to the store, and all of a sudden she's like, hey, you gave us enough money now that we can go to America, and we're going to make this... We recognize those names. Oh, dang! Yeah! Jeff Miller, Wesley Swan, Nate Builder, off in Tim O'Leary. I don't yeah. know. I recognize Rayco. You know I don't. Other, I do recognize the other three. Four. Yeah. And Kyle Hudson, Eric Bush, oh, yeah. Sean Egan, Very Robert Johnson. So. What? They actually Nico? have names in the fucking... You remember Nico? Nico. Remember Storbo? Nico. Storbo. I remember the name. Oh! Uh, never mind. I was thinking, oh yeah, we were going to pay attention to names and... No, I'm thinking of Kid Icarus Uprising. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all those soldiers, Scott Tootin. <laughs> Look at them, Scott. Look at them! Do you <laughs> see all those soldiers? <laughs> Scott, please leave a comment. <laughs> <laughs> you too, Kyle. Kyle, if you're still here, yes, you as well. You know, Kyle never commented. Well, maybe he did at this point. We don't know. We don't know yet. <laughs> we cannot... By the time... We cannot see the future from this recording. By the time it goes up, it'll be the past. Whoa. Because the present eventually the present becomes the past. becomes the past. Yeah. yeah. Wow. I've learned a lot. I've learned a lot from this game. Aww. You wanna come back? Come back, you wanna? Also, like, come back treasure. Oh, yeah. I was watching a video yesterday where they called Iwata the ex-president of Nintendo, and I was like, it would have been better if you'd said former. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. I agree. Okay, this was... Hold on. Hold that pose. Can't even see it. Swirly stars. We can now play that. Okay, I'm expecting. Is there anything else? Um, I'm not gonna upload the scores, so I'm gonna hit B and. That was that was this game. Cine punishment star successor. Fusion. Oh, we're bad. <laughs> Fusion, ha. Huh.